back to my channel. Today I am going to do a massive grocery haul for you. I just got a delivery from Aldi. I feel a little bit silly doing one of these because it's just my groceries, but these are the kinds of videos I really love watching online for some reason. I guess because I'm nosy, but I thought I would do one for you. This is, like I said, huge. I'm thinking it'll last us anywhere from two to three weeks. We might have to um, top up on a few fresh items in a couple of weeks, but this was a big stock up for us and oh, I just love Aldi. I feel like you get so much for your money. So here we go in no particular order, my massive Aldi grocery haul. So the first thing we have is I only had one roll of paper towels left. So I've never bought the Boulder brand. I've been doing like a name brand off of Amazon subscription, but just realized I didn't care to spend that much money on paper towels. So we'll see how we like these. Got some flour tortillas. Always like to have those on hand for um, quesadillas, breakfast burritos, impromptu tacos, and you know, stuff like that. Um, got some grapefruit seltzer water. This is, I don't know if it's the Aldi brand, it's pure aqua which I think I've only seen at Aldi. I don't know that I've ever had this one, but again, I didn't want to spend money on LaCroix this time, so we'll see how those are. Got a loaf of honey wheat bread. I really like their bread. I got kind of crazy and ordered a French baguette just because, I don't know, I felt like it. I thought it sounded like it'd be good with dinner or with cheese. Got some bagels for breakfast. You guys know that I struggle with trying to decide what to eat for breakfast, so I thought I'd try some bagels. Back here, got the classic wavy potato chips. You know, I know they're not healthy for you, but if I don't have them, then I just sit there and crave them, so it's better to just have them, have a few, and move on with my day. Got the Big Dippers tortilla chips. Got some fake Triscuits and some fake Club Crackers. Ivan loves these, oh my gosh. I mean, who doesn't? They're like butter crackers. Um, unsweetened vanilla almond milk. We use this for cereal and for breakfast smoothies. Coffee creamer, French vanilla. Got a jar of their traditional pasta sauce. I wanted just the marinara because I think it's really good, but this is what they had in stock. I think it's like 99 cents or something ridiculously affordable. Back over here, we've got some hearts of romaine just for salads throughout the week. Bananas whole milk, plain yogurt. Um, I eat this and Ivan eats this. Um, strawberries, which look pretty good. I guess it's tis the season, so I'm excited to have those. These little mini peppers, which I love, and we'll probably just eat those as a snack with some hummus, or um, I'll chop them up and use them in a recipe. Got some jumbo flaky biscuits for a weekend breakfast treat giant thing of classic roast coffee. We usually get our coffee through an Amazon subscription. Um, this is just gonna sort of bridge the gap right now because that subscription is not due to deliver just yet. Um, I restocked on flour because they had it, yay. And then also restocked on some vanilla extract. Grabbed a can of corn. I use this a lot in this King Ranch casserole I make, so I like to always have a container on hand and then I got some of these random mixed vegetables simply because they didn't have the frozen vegetables I wanted I wanted the frozen carrots and peas for the baby but they didn't have them so we're gonna try this got some sour cream they were out I usually buy light sour cream um, but they were out of it so this will do got one big seedless cucumber um, we use those for salads, and Ivan really loves cucumbers. It's very surprising to me. I feel like he has a very refined palate for a 10-month-old. I don't think I liked cucumber till I was like 12. Um, got some rigatoni. Got these green pea crisp. I felt like um, they'd be a good snack. I like them, and I think the baby's going to like them too. Um, got some kosher deal sandwich slices. I just love pickles, and we haven't had any in a while. Got some salsa con queso to go with our tortilla chips. Restocked on peanut butter. Two things of their easy mac and cheese just for an easy side for dinner. Crispy oats for Ivan um, and me. I like regular Cheerios. Then I got some 
frosted shredded wheat bite size, which is frosted mini wheats, Aldi brand. Delicious. These are my evil nighttime snack that I eat after the baby's gone to sleep. Um, and also these, the um, Aldi brand kind of Girl Scout cookies. We get the peanut butter filled cookies, which are the faux tagalongs. And then my favorite, the caramel coconut fudge, which are the Samoas. Got some hummus. Stocked up on a ton of baby snacks because I have to send a snack for him every day at daycare. And they have the best prices on them. And they have these little, I call them baby Cheetos. Uh, he's not had the white cheddar, so we're going to try those. And then he does like these little veggie, veggie flavored Cheeto thingies. Got some puffs, yogurt bites he loves, and then I got some unsweetened applesauce packs. These are the ones I really like to keep in the diaper bag in case he needs a snack while we're out. Baby carrots just to have with the hummus, or I'll steam some to give to baby some coleslaw that i plan on using to make um steak tacos with corn tortillas so that should be good so that's the first chunk that's covering my whole like coffee stove and work area so we're gonna come over here and here's all of the rest we've got a what they call a young chicken hmm, poor little guy hanging out in the sink but these are great. I think I, the last time I cooked one of these, I made four different meals out of it. So, and they're only like or in the $5 range. So that's great. Got some turkey breasts for lunches. I've got this turkey polska kielbasa that I'll probably make a pasta dish with, probably with that rigatoni you saw. I've got their salmon. I like their fresh salmon a lot there, but I don't like their frozen salmon fillets, unfortunately. I always just get one fresh one, which you get less for your money, but it's still a good meal. Got some string cheese. We all love string cheese here in this house. Some pork sausage to go with those biscuits for a um, weekend breakfast treat. Um, restocked on our cheese slices for our lunches. And then the I got this as a delivery, and the lady who was shopping for me said their frozen vegetables were really picked over. So I just kind of got what they had. I do like this medley a lot, Prince Edward medley. Got one of those. I think I have another one of those in the freezer anyway. Two things of broccoli. And then Brussels sprouts. We love Brussels sprouts. A thing of shredded cheese just because I feel like you, you can use it for casseroles. You can use it for quesadillas and tacos and... I just always keep it on hand. Got some tropical blend frozen fruit for breakfast smoothies and also some blueberries for the same purpose. Got two blocks of cheese, pepper jack, Colby jack. I think that's it. That is everything. So here's our chicken hanging out in the sink. All of this stuff. I don't know what my total was. I'll put it um, at the bottom of the screen when I find my receipt. But... This is, like I said, a huge haul for us. So anyway, that is my massive Aldi haul. I hope I did it right. This is my first grocery haul. Um, I probably talked too fast. That seems to be a problem I have. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you like these types of videos, please comment below. And I mean, I'm happy to share all of the groceries I buy because again, I'm freakishly interested in them myself. I don't know, why is it so fun? Why, tell me why, I just love it. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.